Hey guys, it's Kayla and for today's video we are taking on a massive project because I just moved back into my house today, got all of my stuff from winter break and Christmas into my house and it's just a disaster. I'll insert a clip here, but it definitely needs to be cleaned, decluttered, organized, and that's what I'm going to be doing all day today. So I figured I'd share with you in a video because New Year is a great time to do a massive overhaul of your room and really clean and organize and get your life together. So I hope this video inspires some of you to kind of get your life together and clean your room for the new year. If you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Leave any comments down below of video ideas you would like to see in the next month or two. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new. And let's get into the cleaning because it's going to take a while. The first thing you need to do when you take on a massive project like cleaning your entire room is put on some pump up music. The first thing I'm going to start with is my closet because that's kind of where the most amount of stuff is going to go. We'll see how it goes. Well, let's get started. I kind of decided that the best plan is to put my shoes up at the top because I don't know I just I need to do something different with my closet because it hasn't really been working and I feel like that's probably the easiest thing and then I'm going to kind of rearrange everything else once I get my shoes up there. I have all my shoes now. These are the ones that I wear all the time. I have um, a few pairs of heels and one pair of boots that I don't really wear that I'm going to put in a box probably underneath my bed. The rest of my closet I need to go through clothes and figure out where I want to put everything and I might put some of my dresses in um, storage because it's still kind of cold. It's getting hot already in January which is sad but I need to pare this down a little bit and then figure out how to reorganize everything down here. I just went through the clothes in my closet and then hung up everything that was packed in my suitcases and it is still really full. I did actually pull out a good pile of stuff. I'm actually the worst at getting rid of clothes, but the problem is like all my winter stuff, like all my sweatshirts and long sleeves take up a lot of room in my closet and in probably a month or two when it gets too hot to wear those regularly, I'll start slowly um, packing them in a box and then putting them or putting them in one of my suitcases and storing them downstairs. Now I'm going to start like organizing the other stuff in my closet and putting all my laundry in there. And yeah, we're going to get through all of this slowly but surely. Okay, it's been a little bit since I filmed anything, but I was just trying to get stuff organized and where I want it and that's like not exciting to watch. I got through pretty much all of my closet. I'm probably going to put some things in there still as I'm like going through stuff but for the most part that is everything in my closet and that's how it's going to look. It looks a lot more like clean and not as like stuff shoved everywhere. So I'm really happy about that. I think I'm going to tackle my desk next maybe. I'm not really sure but slowly but surely my room still looks like a disaster but we're getting there. It's a process. From here you can see pretty much my whole closet. You can see some stuff on my bed too. I'm getting to that, don't worry. But at the top over here, we have my shoe organizer. I have two crates up there, and that's just like random stuff that I really don't use that much, but I need it stored somewhere, so it's there. I've got all my clothes. There's a few things in the laundry, but that's pretty much everything that gets hung. I have my, I have two laundry bins, but one, that one's my actual laundry. Um, and then the next one, I'm not sure what I'm going to put in there. And then we have a three drawer organizer. You can't see the bottom drawer. And then there's the white crate in the front. And that has a ma my makeup caboodle that I got for Christmas. 
has some makeup stored in it and then there's coloring stuff because I want to try and start coloring more so that is all in there and then I have you can see on my closet um, door I have that three shelf organizer which is really helpful the bottom has all my sunglasses the top I'm gonna have all like my vitamins and my medications up there that I need every day and then the middle one I will probably store makeup -y or beauty kind of related things I'm just not sure what is gonna go there so so far that is my closet I don't know if it looks like I've made any kind of progress but I have there's a lot more empty space on my floor and my bed I've gotten some stuff off of it and my suitcases are a little bit more empty so I think we're gonna tackle my desk next and those drawers and my side table drawers I have two little um, drawers right there and I think that's what I'm gonna tackle next So I took a little break to go get food because I had only eaten a Cliff Bar all day. So I went and got Chipotle, which was pretty good. But now I want to finish this today because I don't want to leave this and have to do it later. So got a lot to, to still do, but we're making progress still. When I went to leave for Chipotle, couldn't find my keys for like 10 minutes, but it's getting there. It's getting better. So we'll make it. The sun is starting to go down, so the lighting is going to start getting a little bit wonky and car alarm. Typical, typical day in the life in this house. But I'm going to try and put all my clothes in these drawers and maybe try and take out some stuff that I don't wear anymore. But I'm, like I said earlier, I'm the worst at getting rid of clothes. So we'll see how this goes. I had to put my hair up because it's 9 million degrees today. It's like 80 degrees in January, but that's San Diego for you. Um, I feel like I haven't really been filming. I've just been trying to like, I've literally just been like running around trying to find a place for everything because that's my hardest part is like choosing where I want things to go. Tremendously better, but there's still kind of a lot of things and I think that's the hardest part about like reorganizing and like decluttering your room is like you give up at some point and then you just kind of th shove things everywhere but if you really take the time to like find a place put everything um, where it goes then it'll be a lot easier on you and your room will stay cleaner and more organized in the upcoming months I'm very tired this is taking a lot out of me but I'm really liking the way it looks and I think I'll be able to keep it a lot cleaner this way so let's just finish it up shall we I just finished putting everything away. My room is so clean and organized. I am so happy that I did this. It'll definitely make me feel a lot better going into the new year, the new school year with everything kind of rearranged, clean, organized. If you would like to see a room tour, like a full room tour, a little more in depth, you can see me explain things a little more, show you all my drawers and stuff then let me know in the comments down below and give this video a thumbs up. That's about it for this video. I hope it's actually helpful or motivating if you are thinking about cleaning your room or you know you need to but you're trying to put it off um, because trust me, it'll make you feel a lot better. I think that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Leave any comments down below. If you want to see a room tour, let me know. 
down there or if you want to see any other room or organization videos just let me know and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I'll post be posting new videos every Monday and just maybe some extra videos here and there thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video